Hello guys, another video from my car as every Friday now this year. And today I want to talk about a thing that developers don't spend enough time or attention on. Developers are used to writing code and that's fine, but that code needs to be published or delivered somewhere and for that it needs to be packaged. So I want to talk about packaging the code in multiple senses. If you are a developer at a company and you want to deliver a feature, that feature needs to be documented properly for other developers, then probably present it to the manager with screenshots from that feature as a proof that it works. And of course, the code should be readable and flexible and maintainable. So that's packaging. Working code is the working solution from the code perspective, but it needs to be packaged for the future for other people to consume both developers and non-developers. If you're working on open source package, time and time again, I see packages released with pretty big potential, but so poorly documented without visuals, without examples, that it's hard to even understand what the package actually does or be motivated to test it out. So read me visuals, maybe some videos on Loom or YouTube talking about the problem that you're trying to solve real life examples, that is packaging. Also, if you want to share the advice on development, some tweet or a YouTube video like I'm doing, any advice also needs to be packaged. So while I'm creating the content, I constantly need to think about titles of the videos, thumbnails of the videos, the intro, because without that packaging, many people would not want to watch my video in the first place. So then what's the point of shooting a useful video if no one would watch it? It's similar, for example, to iPhone or other gadgets or other stuff in the shops. Many people buy stuff because it looks good in terms of packaging. So the same logic applies to packaging of the code solutions, code advice. So next time while working on the next feature or project, think about the person who would consume your code and did you do enough job to package your code for it to be easily consumable or so that person would be motivated to consume your code. It actually also applies to testing. So if you want some manager or teammate to test your code, make it easy for them to do so. Provide test cases, provide clear links, clear documentation, clear pointing what they need to test and stuff like that. Otherwise, time and time again, I've seen managers opening the task, which is delivered, and they need to test it, but it seems too hard for them to reproduce the full scenario, and then they go, okay, seems like working, not much to say, okay, done, approved. So they didn't actually test. Why? Because you didn't package it. And it's a general rule or advice almost in life, constantly think about other people who would consume your work. Do it for them not for yourself to tick the checkbox on your to-do list. That's all advice for today and see you guys in other videos.